stemming from the sea. They have one meal called rapi pie that I had the pleasure of trying, where potatoes are grated and the water removed. A hot broth made from chicken, pork, or seafood is then added, along with meat and onion, then layered across with more of the grated potatoes to make a casserole-like dish. It's kind of scary at first, but it tasted just kind of like Thanksgiving stuffing. For work, they started out as hunters, fishermen, farmers, and fur traders. They did a lot of trading with the Indians. They were much more friendly than the Americans were when we colonized North America. But as of today, mostly it is fishing that comes to give them their money. My personal experiences were really awesome. The people were very friendly. It was nice to go to a place that had a distinct culture. The people had like, I don't know, this whole sense of well-being, and it was definitely very distinct. They speak a mixture of French and English called uh, Shiak, and it's something to be heard. It's not anything like you might imagine of French, like French descent or of the Quebecois, which are a completely different society and culture, which they have a part of. The environment was really beautiful. It's a very coastal region there. Like it's rocky coast with cliffs. Temperate weather because of the coast. People think of Canada as being very, very cold, but actually it was really nice when I went. And that is it. Thank you very much. Did y'all have any questions about yes, the speech? Uh, where did you go uh, 
to visit your girlfriend? Uh, it was on the southwest border of Nova Scotia near Yarmouth. Oh. Okay. When you talked about they, the Acadians, uh, returning and having a festival, it wasn't clear, but I'm guessing that they gathered back into the Canadian provinces. Is that correct? Yes, uh, they're kind of spread out. You can actually, they actually do have some people spread out, but the the concentrated regions are all within New Brunswick, Prince Edward Island, and uh, Nova Scotia these days. Otherwise, it's just single people spread out that have moved away. Thank you.